Uh, my name is Gordon Ryan. I'm a black belt uh, under John Danaher and Gary Tonin, training out of uh, out of Hensley Gracie, New York City. Um, you know, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is my my profession. That's what I do for a living. Um, as far as accomplishments go, uh, I'm an ADCC champion, uh, ADCC open weight, uh, silver medalist, Pan American champion, uh, open weight Pan American champion, Nogi World champion, Nogi World's uh, open weight division, uh, and a four time EBI champion. Uh, six foot two, 220 pounds, so trying to be a semi bodybuilder, but also be good at Jiu Jitsu at the same time. Um, so, as far as grappling aspirations, uh, I definitely want to continue to compete at the highest levels uh, in grappling for as long as I can, um, hopefully between 35 and 40. Um, and right now I'm just preparing to fight mixed martial arts, but uh, I'm definitely not ready for that yet. So whenever I'm actually ready to, to start fighting, I'm gonna start fighting while also competing at the highest levels of grappling. So my goal is to, is to compete at the highest levels of MMA and to also compete at the highest levels of submission grappling. Um, so you know, having a never quit mindset, uh, especially in the Hensley Gracie Academy, is very important. Um, you know, some days you come in here and you feel like you could go out and win the world championships, and then you come in the next day and you just get smashed by everybody, especially coming up to the ranks. Um, and you're just like, wow, I should probably never do this again. Like, why am I doing this? Um, and some days even you have good training sessions and you go home and you're like, I'm, I'm exhausted. Like, I don't even want to get up the next day. You, know, you don't get to sleep until 12 at, until 12 at night. And you have to get up at 5.30 the next morning and go and train the whole day. Um, so it's definitely important to have, uh, have some mental fortitude and that. Uh, but also not being a pussy. Um, you know, you can't, if you have an injury, you need to you know, nurse the injury and, um, and take care of yourself, but you also just can't be lazy and just not show up the training just because you don't want to.